You probably already know that it's uh, difficult to generate prompts that is going to bring you incredible results in mid-journey, but seems like mid-journey solved this issue again and they added a prompt generator which is incorporated here in Discord. So I'm gonna show you how it works. All you need to do is type in slash, not imagine, but instead you're gonna type in describe. And we're gonna work with this. You're gonna type in enter. And as you can see, it's gonna show up an uploader here. So all you need to do is drag and drop the image and that eventually is gonna generate you the prompt. So I'm gonna, for example, drag and drop this image in here. Enter, wait for a sec. And check this out, we got four type of description. We got the first, second, third, and fourth. Pink ball with horns and head in style of Unreal Engine, cartoonish character, ZBrush, blocky, grotesque character group. And check this out, here we got like four buttons also, so you can generate. I'm gonna go with the first and submit. And basically it's gonna generate something hopefully similar to this image. By the way, these are like four different prompts and they are going to create four different results. So I can also go with the second and with the third. So check this out, it generated these pink devils and they're like 3D renders. So it won't create the same thing, but eventually it's gonna copy paste the colors and the styles and the 3D effect. And I also gonna type in again and try it out with another one with this 3D model. And I'm gonna generate again, see what happens. I'm also gonna try out a realistic model. And I'm gonna go with this. Let's see what happens. So this is the model in 3D. So it generated three sorts of results. This one is made up by low poly wireframes. And then we got this also, which is a little bit more specific to the original image, but the, all the characters are kind of sad, which is awkward. Let me see the original image. So this was the original one, but unfortunately it made some sad images in here, but the quality is pretty amazing. I also gonna upscale some of these. And then we have this model. It put him in different location. I think this one is in Italy or somewhere. You got all the details, everything is correct. This is what Mid Journey 5 does, guys. And mainly this was it, thanks for watching.